episode of How Would I Paint This? This one is Sunset Poppies. In this, I will explain how you go from this to this, and let's get started. Well, today I'm pretty excited because the reference photo is really nice. This uh, photo is by Diego Torres, uh, and he posted it for free, royalty free use on Pixabay. And uh, the reason why I think it's good is because when I look at it, I, I know what the focal point is. It is the sun, because that is the lightest light in the whole photograph. And I also notice there the compositional, the contrails make a compositional element that direct my eye to the sun. So um, let's compare it to the painting. Um, in, one thing that I noticed that my artist has done is she moved the horizon up a little bit and that was a good move because we do like to have, instead of two equal uh, things equal, we like to have one item dominant and the other one subordinate. So here the uh, land is becoming a little more dominant over the sky. Uh, she's done a really good job of seeing what's interesting about the poppies and the, and the grass, the greenery of the field. That's really good. It's actually pretty easy when you have a good reference photo to figure out how to fix the painting because all you do is compare them and see what's different and then change that. So one thing that we need is that the sun needs to be the brightest spot on the painting. So uh, here in, in the painting, it's not there at all. So we'll put that in. I also noticed that as, as, you know, as it goes out from the sun, it becomes a lower value. It becomes darker and changes color and it's more neutral. So we want to do that. In fact, um, a lot of the painting is darker. If you squint, or it should be darker, if you squint at the reference photo, you see that the land is dark. And it even kind of goes up into the clouds on the sides. Uh, if you squint at the painting, not as much. So we'll darken the whole uh, field and uh, we darken the edges of the clouds and then um, put some highlights on those contrails a little bit. And then the, the other, the last thing is the poppies. So the poppies in the reference photo are backlit. And that's how you're getting these beautiful little sparks of color because they're, they're in between us and the sun. So the sun, here's the poppy, the sun's back here. This is blocking the sun, so it's dark, but the sun is shining on the rim of it and that's what's bright. So it's the backlit, the contrast of the light versus the dark that's making those reds so exciting. So uh, we just need to put um, the darks in with a little bit of that saturated red in there. And then uh, the other thing that uh, in landscape is that you can't use the same color near and far because the same color means it's the same distance away. So, um, yeah, I do see it changes a little bit, but I, in, in my revision, I've made it more, more gray at the background and also the edges are very soft. So, so just emphasized what she did a little bit more. That's all you have to do. So if you liked this video, if you made it this far, give me a like and I'll see you next time. Happy painting.